that's right, baby. Dre Rock is here. It is time for the great one to react to some more Ace Vane, the 1492 Christopher Columbus story. Come on back and let's see what this is all about. Highway, Highway. J Rock has come back come to back. you too. To you too. Do you smell what is happening in the in and in with the millions? And millions of J Rock fans from all over the world, baby. That's right, J Rock is here. About to check out some more Ace Vein. Make sure you go after this video and check out the other Ace Vein reactions J Rock has up right now on the People's Channel, all right? But we're not gonna waste any more time. Come on, Ace Vein. Let's check this thing out. Hey, hey, hold, hold, hold on for a second. Oh, shit, 12. Yeah, yeah, hey, what y'all, hey, what the hell you doing? What are you doing, bro? I'm trying to get the fuck away from you. Something wrong with the starter on this bitch, though. Yeah, yeah, bitch, y'all. Nah, that sounds like the alternator. Let me take a look at it real quick. What? Hell no, you ain't looking at my fucking horse. I know what the fuck going on my horse. That's the alternator, man. That's the starter. Fuck up. Yeah, bitch, just wait right there. I'm not looking at it. Hold on, no. I why the fuck are you chasing him down? Because the fucking king and queen want to talk to your dumb ass again. For what? They already called me stupid. Yes, and they still thoroughly believe that. But they're desperate. They have no choice but to go with you right now. They really think God doesn't love them anymore. They're, they're just grasping on whatever they can get. Bruh, I knew 1492 was going to be my ear. Now let me just check your ass there. Hey, what, what, what are you doing? doing? Why are you kneeling? Oh, so I'm gonna be knighted for the voyage. Knight you for the voyage? Why the fuck? Why the fuck? Cause I need, I need that, I need that title, cause so I can get the powers to, to be a knight. Be driving the boat at night. Cause your knight's got night vision. The shit you just said out your mouth is in Well, that's impossible because I'm, I'm a fucking genius. But, you know, I'm gonna need them powers, though. So just tap your boy on the shoulder right quick. Look, we're gonna give you tree boats and a crew full of semen. And you're gonna find us some gold, some land, and see, see what kind of wage they have. Yeah. Okay, cool. So how many holes in the, in the boat? There are no holes on the crew. You're not getting any holes. Are you gonna be on a mission with, with a bunch of semen and no holes? Yes, your only focus should be on the mission. Now, Your Majesty, just do it. It's gonna be sad as fuck on the boat. Fuck. You better develop some allergies and some shit so you won't have to smell. Uh, well, how you gonna have boats with no holes? Like, what's the point of getting a yacht if you ain't gonna have We're not in the business of financing late 90s rap videos. Do I look like fucking Death Jam? You know I had holes in this boat, bro. Like some zebra holes and, and, and giraffe holes and chicken bitches and shit. Where in the scripture do you see anything about chicken bitches? Genesis 529 is no, no art. I've never read anything about chicken bitches in the entire Bible. What is chicken bitches, bro? It's in the New Testament. Bro, don't tell me you're still reading the Old Testament. You know, they, they dropped the, the remix, bro. The King James Version, bro. You gotta read that one. Cause that's Basketball player remixes the Bible. Yeah, and he just won his fourth. NBA championship, yeah, bro. He, he might be the goat for real. He had whole goats on the boat. Oh, goats on the boat. Give him Get him thrown. Oh, shit. That's just a quote. I don't, I don't understand getting thrown from goats. Oh, I, I, I'm, I'm going to cop that. That's fire. Like, when would they drop the remix? That's what King James rewrites the Bible. So keep in mind, it's 14 92. So none of the shit you two guys are discussing is historically accurate. I mean, for real, all y'all just need to shut the fuck up and let this bullshit story be bullshit by itself without making you additional bullshit into it. Now, everybody in the world knows Christopher Columbus is a fucking moron. Do we not? Me and Tom are exactly the same. Oh, no, that's real shit. You're a moron. Instead of everybody believing that it is flat. Say what? Hey, is, what? Who, who believes the Earth is flat? 
It's, it's yeah, flat. Everybody, everybody, everybody believe the earth flat, bro. Like it's, that's, that's the way everybody know now. But I believe because I'm different and I'm a, I'm a damn genius. It, the earth is round. Everybody believes already that the earth is round. So I mean, like, why are you saying like you're the only one that knows this? Dude, I'm another one that's wanna want to want to debate with a genius. Debate, look, man. The earth. And my theory that I'm going to move I mean, is wrong. Yeah, it's it's not being a flat surface. Oh, I'm going to the emphasis if I can talk. I don't, bro. Like, is that how to get to where our destination is? So, so this is a new information. Some people have already tried this, and your data is actually outdated and inaccurate. Well, you talking about me being inaccurate? You can shut your fat ass up. Because who else in here got permission from the king and queen to go, go fuck around and all have the world measured smaller than it actually is? It's going to take you more time to get to where you think you're going. You're going to end up hitting a whole nother piece of land that Man, is not the destination. Bitch ass up. You don't know nothing about me, bro. I'm a goddamn genius. Don't tell me where the fuck I'm going. You know what? You're talking about destination. Destination needs balls in your mouth, bro. And you're looking like an early 90s alternative hip hop rapper. And Rush Limbaugh. I don't understand anything you well, just like said. like a damn cream of wheat pulp in the Sopranos. I don't understand any of that shit you just said. Just, just give me the papers. I'll, I'll sign whatever for it. To the new world! Hey, bro. Yeah, I spent a day of research on this, and, and based on my calculations, we're in the middle of the fucking nowhere. How far away is that from somewhere? It's exactly fuck of I know, miles, east, west, north, or south. What the fuck? Hey, who the fuck hired you, bro? I am. I'm a star. Hey, hold up. Y'all getting crazy? that shit to say? We were supposed to be there where the fuck we going six months ago. Where the fuck are we at? Hey, this is some bullshit that got me. Hey, they told me to do it for the time. Wait, I'm Based, Based on, on my calculations, if you look here, you'll see a map. <laughs> bro, we got to fucking die. Now we're going to die, bro? That's what it is. You pay me for that dying. Based, Based on, on my calculations, calculations we, we die. We go. Bro, where are we? You own Wilson and look like I don't like fucking own Wilson. I don't like Matthew McConaughey. You don't like fucking Rocky Dennis. Get the fuck out of my face. And for the rest of y'all, just go ahead and start a new one, bro. Say about my calculations, we die. I'm going to tell you, bro. Like, I'm fucking lost, too. So, but if, if you go stab me or some shit, just don't do it in my face. Do it to where I can still have open casket. So, so, you know, my hoes can see me one more time and shit, whatever. Did we just fucking hit something? God damn, my insurance gonna be high as Wiz Khalifa. Move the fuck away. The scum. Goddamn genius. So, so this is, uh, this is it? Shit, it is not. What are we waiting on? Let's colonize this motherfucker. All right, let's do it. What the hell are y'all doing? Like, who the fuck said that? I did. Who the, who the hell are y'all? Hey, what's up, bro? My name is Chris. And I just want to uh, introduce myself. I'm the one who discovered uh, your land. And you're an Indian now. Hey, what the fuck you just call me, bro? Uh, I don't know what the fuck you're saying. Hey, look, uh, translator. Hello. Me white. You different. Me boss. I don't think I'm getting through to him, but luckily I am extremely fluid in his language and, and, and the vast vocabulary. Oh, let me try this. You different. Me white. Me boss. Hey, what's, what's wrong with your mans? Tell us Gargamel looking ass quit talking to me. Does anybody right? know what this motherfucker is saying? Well, he's speaking in the same as that language. I don't have a goddamn clue what he's saying. But he's different from us, I know that, so we're in charge. What is your definition of discover in the language you think you're speaking different from me? Because if you think discovering is the same thing I think it is, I don't think you discovered anything. Bro, I, I can't fucking do this no more. Hey, hey, bring this motherfucker a hat. Hey, I, I, I don't want a fucking hat. Mm-hmm. Uh, there you go. Really did not get off to a good start with the neighbors. Don't worry, I got that handle, bro. I got the H I C coming out today, bro. Hey, Indian in charge, bro. Indian, bro. What the fuck, Wiz? Did you hear me call this shit Indian when I pulled up? Hey, Captain Columbus. He here or whatever. 
Hey, how you doing, Chief? My name is Christopher Columbus, and I just wanted to introduce you, introduce myself, because I'm a new manager of uh, this land and whatever. The, the fuck is he talking about? be a couple of changes, I'm not going to lie to you, but it's nothing to be afraid of. Change is good. You know what I'm saying? First of all, is the uniform. So, so we got your, we got your shirt, and, you know, I'm, I'm going to just go ahead and put this on. Perfect. You know, you look like you're ready to start dusting shelves and um, making lemonade for me already. Let me to tell you that no one knows where the gold is here. That no one knows what we're talking about. You motherfuckers don't know what gold is? I can't go back to the king and queen talking about I ain't got no gold, bro. I got to take them something back. I, what y'all know? Shit, take them back some of the Indians or some shit. I don't know. Wow, bro. Really? I mean, yeah. I'm mean, using people as currency. I mean, now that you said it out loud, it do kind of Jeez, sound bro, like fuck. I don't know how nobody never thought about this before. No, shit, uh, thank you, bro. For real. Like, so you think I can get paid for the trip in the world? I mean, all the exposure I done got you, bro. I feel like I, I really done paid you already with it. So a couple of y'all stay here and finish colonizing this bitch, and then we go grab a couple of the natives, and we go ship out tonight. At night, the Santa Maria sank and Christopher Columbus drowned. He actually didn't, of course, but you, don't you kind of wish he did? He was kind of an asshole. Actually, he was more than an asshole. He was downright evil. A list of his crimes against humanity included rape, pedophilia, murder, torture, slavery, and the list goes on, all in the name of Christianity. And no, that's not a dig at anybody's religion. That's just a fact. A lot of people use religion to do evil shit all the time, unfortunately. And look, just because I killed him on my story and didn't tell the full real story, don't feel slighted. This is not the first time you've been lied to about Christopher Columbus. I mean, even look at look at this fucking cartoon. He looks nothing fucking like this. They got him looking like Captain America in this shit, but in real life, he looks like a female PE teacher going through menopause. And my apologies to any female PE teacher going through menopause watching this. Um, basically, short story long, this guy was a fucking asshole, an idiot, and any fucking vile thing you can describe, and any fucking other insult, insert here, because this guy was a piece of shit. And they keep lying to us and telling us he's a hero. He's not a hero. He's a failure. Didn't get to where he's trying to go at all. Not even fucking close. And he didn't even land in America. Didn't discover America at all. And can't discover shit that people already discovered. Genius. So it's nothing to be inspired about from him. Just, just need to wipe this idiot from history. And, 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 and fucking tell the truth about him. Quit naming shit after him. Because he just doesn't fucking deserve it. Fuck Christopher Columbus. The end. So, J-Rock says this. Shout out to my brother Ace Vane. Little history lesson with some comedy in there. Ace Vane style. All right? Um, keep doing your thing, brother. J-Rock gonna keep checking out your videos. You are hilarious. All right, if you're not subscribed to Ace Vane's channel, Make sure you go over there, subscribe, and tell them that the YouTube people's champ, J-Rock, sent you his way, all right? Post your comments down below and let J-Rock know what you thought of his reaction to this video. No rhyme intended on that line. If you enjoyed the Great One's reaction, then like button, subscribe, and share. And be sure to hit that bell so you can be notified when it is time to be electrified. Thank you for joining J-Rock. Stay tuned for my next video.
Mamba, Gigi, and Wakanda forever. Hit me smell! Oh! With a rock! It's cooking.